Let's talk about the contact points on the bow itself by first talking about why we hold the bow down here at the frog in the first place. Well, in the Baroque era and before it, the bow was held in all sorts of places along the stick. The way the bow was made in combination with the gut strings made this kind of bow hold in this part of the stick more ideal. As music evolved and progressed, more extremes were written into the music, more highs and lows and faster back and forth. Thus, instruments became stronger to withstand all this and musicians began to play with different techniques to bring out these extremes. That brings us to the bow. By holding it at the frog, the heavy part of the bow, I am able to get lots of weight into the bow right here at this point. That allows for heavy accents, great big fortissimos and crescendos, and all sorts of other extended techniques. By contrast, this puts very little weight at the tip so that when I want to play very soft and very light and create all of those kinds of colors, I have the option to do so. 